So I'm going to give you a word that I, I had a, a dream that ended up being this word. And I think you're going to really enjoy this. I think this is really speak to many of you. And I want you to take this, like, I don't know how you receive prophetic words, but I like to just be able to be in a quiet place and listen to it. Or like sometimes I'm in my car or sometimes in a, you know, and I believe in giving general prophetic words because sometimes God activates your faith to access him through the word and through his spirit when you hear these kinds of words. So even though it may sound generic, what we've seen, and we've seen it by hundreds of thousands of people, when they receive a word, sometimes we'll do a prayer altar call time and say, God's doing this in the, and, and with a lot of you, or God's doing this with some of you. And we'll, we'll do it in live meetings. Sometimes it's over the internet like this. And what we tend to see is that there's people who learn how to wrap their faith around something that's available in God that they didn't see with their spiritual eyes before we gave the word. So yes, not all these words apply to all people, but what you'll know it's for you because your spirit will be activated by it. You will have a hope or a faith that's not just like, I wish that was me, but you'll feel God in it. So I saw uh, this the, in the last couple of weeks, actually, it was over the last month. I saw pins coming down from heaven and I saw they were given out so many believers in the body of Christ could really sign papers that were some of the most important documents we would sign possibly in our lives or possibly in this season. And I saw people taking off a shoe and giving it to another person which represents the Old Testament when you when you take off your shoe. This sounds funny. When you took off your sandal and you gave it to somebody, that was a contract. Like modern day contracts, we sign papers. Old fashioned contracts in the biblical days, they would take off their sandal because they're 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 going to walk with you or they're going to give you their walk. They're going to walk. It's it's a symbolic sign of giving you making covenant or making. So I saw shoes being given, and I also saw pens being given. Now, interestingly enough, not only is this the old the way that you know the Old Testament the world that they would make covenant. But there was also uh, people who it caused their destiny to move forward because they made these contracts and covenants. Like in Ruth 4.8, the closest relative of Boaz said, buy it for yourself. He removed his sandal and gave him the ability to buy it. Basically, he's like, he's saying, here you go. Well, I felt like God was saying he's giving you the ability to make contracts and also sign deals. And many of you are going to get ready to sign deals that you could have never had brokered. You could never have had this miraculous opportunity without God. These contracts, again, miraculous contracts, real estate, property deals to come through, invoices that contradict the current recession notices, and even checks that you never thought you'd be able to write out uh, these big of amounts or these big of purposes. Some of you are going to be signing legal papers for justice. Get ready for a wave of justice. There's going to be court cases that are signed off, custody battles that are in your favor, real estate wars that are finally done, personal reputation defamation wins that are going to be completely, they're going to come through in this next season. And some of you are signing correspondence with people of influence. Get ready for correspondence with people who are above your social economic status, above your, your relational status network right now. They're people you wouldn't have an opportunity to correspond with through maybe online, maybe it's in person, maybe it's through actual correspondence of mail. People who have the keys to unlock projects and resources and their relational networks to you. Get ready to send emails to people you've never dreamed you'd be able to talk to or correspond with. God is bringing connections together for us. And you're gonna find yourself signing letters and emails that you didn't think you'd ever be able to write to politicians or ministers or leaders or cultural influencers, celebrities, and maybe even people in your industry. And God's giving these pens to writers who are going to use their voice for influence in the kingdom. We're going to see more people writing books and, and scripts and poetry and music. And he's giving a Psalm 45 theme. And I want to read this to you, Psalm 45, verse 1. It says, my heart is stirred by a noble theme as I recite my verses for the king. My tongue is the pen of a skillful writer. Some of you are going to be hit with that right now that your tongue is going to be like a pen, just the, the beautiful, the poetry that will come out of your mouth, the way you're going to be writing, maybe giving speeches, maybe giving talks. I know I prayed this over someone who's going to do a TED Talk, and she did way better than she thought she would. She said, I felt the anointing to be able to give my subject away to the masses in a way that I've never felt before because God's spirit came on me. And he touched my tongue. He touched my mouth. And she had the scripture given to her right beforehand too after I prayed for her. Well, this Christmas, I also bought pins for our partners as a gift to bless what they're going to be signing because I kept having this recurring vision and theme. And I pray that God would give you that pin in the, in the spirit as well. Some of you might be even get a pin in the natural or shoes in the natural and take that as a sign that God's giving you this, that maybe somebody's going to give this to you. And, and it's really God. Maybe you already got it. And it's really God showing you, I'm going to give you the ability to sign off, to be able to sign some things, to be able to write some things, to be able to make some contracts, to be able to make some agreements. And God wants to give you more authority and he wants to position you more for the Father's will. And he has a desire for you to be able to influence the world. So I want to give that to you today as the prophetic word because God is going to allow you. And I'm just going to pray, Holy Spirit, would you allow us to register with whatever part of that word is ours? Lord, I pray that there's contracts that need to be signed or if there's 
legal issues that need to be signed off, that you would give us the anointing, the authority, the support, the resources to push those things through beyond what we could do in the natural, beyond what we could do with our own strength or the strength of current people involved, that you would do something by your might, by your power. Wow, I just feel the prophetic anointing. Some of you are going to hear from God right now. So I'm going to encourage you as you're listening to this, give God some time and listen today. Spend some time with him today and ask him what he's showing you. And I just thank you so much for being here as part of our show today. The Sean Bull Show, we exist. I exist right now so that you guys can discern the times we're in and have a spiritual, biblical, and also prophetic take on what's going on in popular culture and news stories all around the world. I'm going to encourage you to keep discerning. Sign up online to our news uh, mailing list because it's going to help you. And also, this show's made possible by support. Thank you for the donations that came through the stars that came through on Facebook today. You guys are awesome. Thank you for that. But also, you can get a tax-deductible donation by going to bullsministries.com and becoming a partner or giving a one-time donation. And this is the season. We're in the end of the year. We have some goals in the end of the year so we can really go into 2023 uh, fully supported. Even we have a Pray.com partnership coming up where we're going to have our content there as well, including the Sean Bull Show. So I'm going to encourage you guys to give and help us to go that direction. We keep getting better and better opportunities, but it does take resources from generous donations from people just like you who are watching. And every dollar counts. If you become a partner, we really give back to you in some really unique ways. So I'm going to encourage you, come be part of our partner family and you will feel like you're part of a family. God bless you guys. Have a great day.